Hey, Strong Side, welcome to Whiteboard Wednesday. Today, we're continuing to talk about the sit-up. Now, I've addressed why a sit-up is important. It's a functional movement, helps with our balance. It protects us from injury when we're doing heavier lifts like deadlifts and front squats. And we've talked about what to do if you're not really able to do sit-ups or if high volume sit-ups bother you. But today, we're gonna talk about training above and beyond the minimum. So, the minimum function of life is to be able to sit up with your own body. You're laying in bed, you're on the floor, you wanna do a sit up and you just sit up. We train above and beyond that so that we can have a really strong core to protect our body and so that a sit up is always easy. We want to go through some strong core progressions to continue to make the sit up always an easy movement and that's gonna make us functional for life. Now, for some of our more advanced athletes, I wanna to talk today about how do I get from sit ups to toes to bar. Now, of course, a toes to bar is a rig movement, a gymnastics movement. It requires some also lat strength in your upper body and a lot of technique. But a lot of you are like, I can do sit-ups all day. Why can I not raise my legs up to the bar? What can I do to progress that? I can do 100 sit-ups and I feel fine. Maybe I'm not even sore. What do I do next to get to where I wanna be or how do I just get stronger in my core? So I'm gonna show you a couple movements. Come on over here with me. These are things that you can do, accessory work before or after class to strengthen your core. Some of it can be done at home. So the first one I wanna show you is just here on the ground with some dumbbells. Okay, this is a really good movement if you feel like you're strong in your core, you do a lot of sit-ups, but you're not able to finish at the top of that toe to bar and really get that final flick. You're gonna lay on your back, you're gonna extend your arms straight up above, and you're gonna sit up and reach these dumbbells up to the ceiling. So all the way up and reach up to the top, come back down, all the way up. That's a great option, okay? To really build that strength and you're gonna see an improvement in your knee raises and your toes to bar. From there, we are gonna use the GHD machine. I know some of you have maybe never been on this. It's a super great piece of equipment. You're gonna hop up here, all right? You're gonna hook your feet in. I promise, once your feet are in, you're not going to fall. You want it so your butt is just over the edge of the mat. You're gonna extend all the way back and come all the way up. And up. That is going to work your entire core from top to bottom. It's gonna build a lot of strength, okay? And take away maybe some of the momentum that you had in your sit-ups to build that strength. Now. The next thing I want to show you, just for kicks, is called a terminator. I'm going to do it with a PVC pipe today because I don't have a buddy to take it away from me. You can do it with dumbbells as well for safety because you can drop those. If you're going to use a barbell or a technique bar, you want to have a friend here to help you out. Come back into a plank and press. All right, so if you can hold that out there, Maybe hold for 20 seconds. Maybe try to do 10 presses with your dumbbells. It's challenging with just a PVC pipe, but if you want a little extra, a technique bar or a barbell, it's gonna be something to help you out. These are things that you can do strong side to advance your core strength and to get all the gymnastics movements you wanna have. Have a great day.